having a work ethic is incredibly important, especially in medicine. If you don't show up for work, your patients are going to be coming in from sometimes a great distance to see you, or they'll be sitting on the operating table waiting for you. You can't just not show up. You have to have a work ethic. You have to come to work. And when you're at work, there's ethics about taking care of people. You can't just talk about what you did during the day necessarily to the general public. You can't talk about patients' specifics to other people. It's not allowed. You have to respect their privacy. And that's part of the ethics of being a physician. Um, having a work ethic, though, means that you're going to come to work on time. If you love your job, you're not going to have a problem with it. It's not hard. It's not hard to have a work ethic. When it's hard is when you don't want to do it. And that's what you have to learn how to do. When you're in school, sometimes you'll take classes you don't like. And the key is to continue to work hard in those classes and do well in them, even if you don't like them. And maybe more if you don't like them, because it's going to be harder for you to do the work in that class that you don't like. And so what I've always done is I've found things about it that I like. I always find something that I like about it. It's like climbing a mountain. I love climbing mountains, but sometimes I get hot, sweaty, and I'm not happy. But I get to the top, I feel so good. And when you're doing a class that you don't like, and you write that essay, and you rewrite that essay, and you're like, I am just so tired of this essay, and you rewrite it one more time, and you pass it in, and you get an A, you just feel so good. So there's always a light at the end of the tunnel. 